Hi there, this is the uh, driveway mechanic and today I'm going to show you how to talk to your car using a Bluetooth device. Um, this is a uh, OBD, actually it's an OBD2 diagnostic interface I bought on Amazon.com for about $23 which is a lot cheaper than going to the dealership and uh, have those guys uh, check my car or even to go to place like AutoZone where of course you need a working car just to get there so sometimes you don't mind it's a good investment I think so basically this interface plugs in to a standard um, uh, ODB2 plug uh, this car is a 2004 Jaguar X-Type with a 3 liter engine so the dashboard might look familiar to you the plug is normally on just about any car I know of uh, the plug is usually on the bottom and it looks like uh, like this guy here and what you do is you plug in the device if I can find it yep there she is make sure it's in there snug So to be able to talk to the device, uh, you need a smartphone. This is a standard Samsung S4. And what you need to do is uh, download an app called Torque. Download it, install it. I think there's actually a free version. Um, and you need uh, Ignition on. After you install it, um, I'm gonna pair it with the Bluetooth. It is a Bluetooth device. So, you just go in there and start up Torque. What you'll be getting is uh, low indicators, you know, your position satellite is the Bluetooth, it's connected. So at this point, uh, to read in the fault codes, you go to the fault codes and scan for it, and it's going to talk to the card. It takes a little bit, it uh, pulls down on the information from the car's computer and uh, hopefully it's gonna tell us what's wrong with it. Today I have a sick cat, this Jaguar is acting up so there they are, fault codes. So we have a P1344 code for a powertrain failure. So, we're gonna find out uh, if we can fix it, hopefully. What it does uh, when I start up the engine, there's an engine light on. It stays on. And then as soon as I hit the gas pedal, sometimes it goes into uh, Jaguar's famous Limpco mode. Ah, there it is, the limp mode. So I gotta find out what's wrong with it, but uh, that's basically how you pull down your uh, fault code. And this is a kind of a cool app, because it also allows you to clear the fault codes. It gives you a warning message, but if you hit OK, um, it's gonna clear out the computer. There it is, blank. Of 
course next time you scan it for fault codes it's gonna come up again because it has problems right now but if you go back to the main menu uh, you can see that um, there's a real-time information dashboard in the app and that's basically um, tells you the acceleration throttle position, your current speed and so forth, vacuum and that can be basically set up for for different uh, modes uh, to exit the app be sure to go to the menu and choose quit otherwise torque's gonna live in the background with a uh, low nagging so all right thanks for watching and take care